Hey everybody, Leo Honeycutt here with people in places around the greater Baton Rouge area. And no, you don't have to stay inside your house and not venture out. You can go out in small groups and now would be a really good time to take your family out and explore Baton Rouge. Now why? John Kelton tells us why. Because he has walking tours that are really kind of fun. I like these ideas. Well, we do walking and food tours. and they're, oh, they're so, Even better. <laughs> even better. And you can't beat food. It's really kind of a, a magic combination. You have the history where you get to see Baton Rouge. Uh, if you choose a food tour, you get to visit five outstanding restaurants downtown. Nice. And then there's the synergy with, between your family or your friends and perhaps some new friends. Uh, that you want to bring in from out of town that always want to see what you got. That's right. Yeah. right. Uh, they are, enjoy Baton Rouge. The walking tours are a great way to see downtown because it's up close and personal. Mm -hmm. Uh, of course, there's plenty of opportunity to ask questions. Sure. And the, uh, it's just an amazing package. Yeah, it really is. I like the old starting at the old state capitol. So you have a tour that starts there and then does what? Well, I have one that, that focuses on that area. And so you're going to talk about everything from the history of the capitol. Uh, we try to find the, the highest vantage point we can mm -hmm. in that area. So we might go to the sixth floor of the Shaw Building, or oh, wow. if, the, if, if it's open, we'll go into the 19th Judicial District Courthouse and get an 11-story view of Baton Rouge. Nice. Same thing's true at the north end of town when you get to the state capitol and you go to the 27th floor. Every one of those views is a unique perspective on Baton Rouge, and it's a great place to point out historical sites. It's a great place to uh, entertain questions and great places to take pictures. I mean, the pictures, Baton Rouge is a beautiful town. How long does these walking tours normally take? Well, the, the <laughs> walking tours are 90 minutes. The food, That's it? Uh-huh. Well, you must be have people hustling along. Hey, come well, on, gotta go, gotta go. <laughs> well, and the food tour is three and a half hours. Oh, the, <laughs> they We make the, the walking tours 90 minutes. If people want to combine the two, uh -huh. then we'll do it, then it's a three hour tour, kind of like Gilligan. Wow. The, uh, but the 90-minute tours uh, is something that um, is, accommodates you know, people's mm -hmm. uh, energy level, uh, all the possible things there. Now, you were telling me that there's a fresco uh, wall in yeah. the 19th JDC that was destined to be in the new state capitol. That's right. The, uh, one of the things that we do is we point out a lot of the art that's available for public viewing in Baton Rouge. Well, Which you really wouldn't know unless somebody who knows can tell you about it. Because you just it, sort of pass it. So Conrad Obrizio was, con, uh, was uh, commissioned to do a, a fresco to hang in the new state capitol and cover the wall where the bullet holes are from the Huey Long assassination. Wow. When that fresco was ready to put up, Earl Long was governor, mm -hmm. and he refused to allow the fresco to be hung. Because he wanted the bullet holes to still be there for people to see. And so that fresco ended up down in New Orleans at the Supreme Court building. After Katrina, in doing all the restoration, mm -hmm. they moved it up to the 19th Judicial District building. Back to Baton Rouge. On the 11th floor, where it's beautiful, it's on display, and the public can go there, but you don't just pass by. See, I didn't know you could take a tour into the night end of the courthouse. I didn't know you could take a tour there. As long as you aren't carrying guns and knives. <laughs> <laughs> yes, good. that would be a plus. <laughs> uh, okay, so. And, and plus, from that same floor, you get this great view down 4th Boulevard at the new state capitol. Wow. It's a great place to look from. What a great idea. I like this. And, and I really like that food tour. i got to take that food tour. Now, to find out more information, we go to the website. The website is enjoybatonridge.com. Uh, you can also call 225-369-3078. Is there a, what size group can you take? How big can your group be? The, I, I do couples, so I would do two. The largest group we is, tends to be around 12. Okay. That way, uh, you know, the, everybody kind of stays together and everybody right. can be involved. Okay. All right. Well, John Kelton, thank you very much for being here today. I like that. Thank you Important. so much. A great idea. Tour Baton Rouge. Uh, enjoy Baton Rouge. And you have these tours of downtown for things that you see every day if you're downtown Baton Rouge, but you don't really know what they mean. This guy knows. We're going to have more right after this.